Here comes one dangerous man, Solo Sokoa. The following contest is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring, representing the Bloodline from Las Vegas, Nevada, weighing in at 250 pounds, Solo Sokoa. The younger brother of the Usos, but had a far different upbringing. When Jimmy and Jay were getting their start in WWE, Solo was still getting into fights on the street. Sokoa only has one thing on his mind right now, and that's destruction. This could get ugly fast. One of the most destructive forces we've ever seen. And his opponent from the Isle of Samoa, weighing in at 350 pounds, the Samoan Bulldozer, Umaga! The Samoan Bulldozer looks ready to unleash brutality on the grandest stage of them all. We've seen that brutality taken out on the likes of Batista, and Bobby Lashley at WrestleMania. You gotta believe that trend's gonna continue tonight. You wanna talk about a scary man to be standing across the ring from? This superstar is going to be face to face with Solo Sokoa. Sokoa set for competition here, clearly focused as ever. Focused and with a target acquired, Cole. Sokoa's never not in a bad mood. We can already see he came ready for a beatdown. Strangely, I think beating down his competition is the only thing that eventually puts him in a good mood. And even that's debatable. Just look into his eyes right now. He's standing across the ring from the Samoan bulldozer Umaga, though. And let's just really think about what that means. It means destruction, relentless destruction. Yeah, Umaga is just as powerful and unstoppable as his nickname suggests. Byron, a match like this is when we see how merciless someone can be. What will this come down to? This is about who can weather the storm. A superstar can attack at will here. Everything is a weapon. That is what makes this so dangerous. It's anything goes. There are no limits here. And it can be chilling to see the lengths someone's willing to go to to destroy another human being. And by chilling, I mean beautiful. Sokoa just unable to stop this attack. Solo needs to start reacting quicker. Oh, a strong impact. Escapes in a nick of time. Absolutely no telling what's underneath the ring tonight. I can't begin to imagine what he's got planned here, guys. Maybe it's a yard sale. Umaga heading top rope. here from the top that one fails to land missed the mark <laughs> and he's able to counter now umaga looking for some momentum yeah but umaga needs to maintain that offense now a completely relentless attack from umaga umaga is determined right now Opportunity now for him to get some separation and gather himself. Choke slam! <laughs> Setting him up for the flatliner. <laughs> and Sakoa on the receiving end again. So much perseverance being tested. He foiled that attempt. And, oh, fiery Larry. Great, 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 great
officiating as the ref noticed he was on the ropes. Big forearm. He's in his clutches. What a headbutt. Vicious. Catastrophic move from the Samoan Bulldozer. Looking wobbly in the corner. Taking things way too far. <laughs> oh, look at this. So ruthless. And Umaga is all business now. Pinpointing the leg. Punishing the leg. He's one step ahead there. The adrenaline is pumping, and the WWE Universe... Oh, he gets what he deserves for all that gloating. Belly to belly. Something here. Wait a minute. Hoist it up. Kids first across the barricade. Tough position to be caught in here. Oh, no. Uh oh. Look at this. She just tossed the leg. Taking this one back to the ring now. Some dangerous redecorating. I think the table really ties it all together. He's got a plan for that table, and it does not involve a dinner party. On the top, all the way to the outside. And after that, you know things have just kicked up a notch. Pedal to the metal right now. Sharp elbow 
elbows to the body, looking to fight his way out. A back elbow smash, nothing fit. Uh -oh. What reflexes to stop Sakala? One finds such. This will. Uh oh! Solo reverses and looks to capitalize. Shot right to the gut. Spinning Solo! Savage power coming from Solo. Shoulders. Got to protect that region or the lights can go out fast. Oh, got caught with a punch to the face. How's that for a counter? Send him up for the flatline. Man, face first. There are no words for the ride these fans have gone through in this match. It has been a roller coaster, and I don't think the ups and downs are over yet. Setting them up on the table. Looks like we want tables. Top rope, putting it all on the line. From the heavens. Splash from the top. He just got broken in half with that one. Broken in half, splinters everywhere. He might as well just stay down because the rest of this match isn't good. Here it comes! Solo and Spike! Feeling like it's over for Sokoa. Looking vulnerable on that top turnbuckle. Uh-oh, from the top. Snap there from the top rope. Solo must be getting phased by this attack. Sokoa needs to better assess the situation to turn this around. Rapid fire Samoan drop continues the attack on the core. It could prove to be an effective strategy. Umaga exerting his dominance. The claw is in. Agonizing. Feed off the WWE Universe. This place is starting to rock. Momentum fully shifted to Umaga. Umaga continues to maintain the advantage. He is looking to do some serious harm. Dropped with a massive uppercut. a perfectly placed target. Great wherewithal on the counter. Saw it coming and went for the defensive headbutt. Oh, man. Oh, I might have just broken something. Super kick. And Sakoa on the receiving end again. Solo's perseverance being tested. Solo is falling behind. He's open to start a rush of his own with that attack. Flatliner, man, face first. Not even In full control here. Face for a turnbuckle. Momentum fully shifted to Umaga. Full focus from Umaga. Solo could be turning his fortunes around. Oh, he's going to the pin. This could be it. End of the pay window. Unbelievable display of will in the late stages of this matchup. Sit, sit down. Placing them into the corner. The whole ring 
in between them. Boom! Solo with a timely counter. Taking this to the floor. He's rummaging for some sort of equalizer underneath the ring. Getting back into the ring. in this one. This was definitely not the way the Enforcer expected things to go. 